I couldn't sleep one night and I was just, I had loads of things going around in my head and I think I'd, I'd bought a map from a charity shop that day. I very rarely work on anything that's not figurative. Um, it's just something about the, the human figure that I, I like to get across in my work. Um, it's always interesting. I think a lot of people think that perhaps I kind of look for a face perhaps in the map to begin with or I'll look for certain structures, you know, almost like uh, seeing shapes in clouds, but generally I find that any portrait I can fit onto almost any map, um, but the more cluttered the map, the better the scope, because there is so much pattern there, there is just so much, it's, it's all sitting there and it's just a case of bringing out those particular details. I'll look at the person that I'm going to draw the portrait, I'll look at my subjects and the figure and I'll look at the map as well um, and I'll try to make links between them in my head. I, I could look at a map for maybe an hour and I'll just sit and I'll, I'll look at the two and I'll compare the two and in my head I'll try and make bridges and that's when I start to build the framework and then from there um, I can pretty much synchronise the two across. One thing that I, I really enjoyed about working on the Bartholomew series was that it was nice to be able to illustrate those people actually had a hand in making uh, their respective maps. It was almost like uh, paying a kind of homage to the Bartholomew family. I was pleased with the final outcome, um, it was great working on the, the Bartholomew series, uh, particularly onto their respective maps, uh, and I was happy overall, yeah.